So today we're going camping, man, all right? So I actually rented myself a trailer upstate as well as an ATV. So I'm pretty excited for that. We woke up pretty early today. And um, yeah, man, I'm pretty excited for this camping trip. What we're probably going to do is uh, I'm not going to pick up the trailer until I get closer upstate. And then uh, we're probably going to pick up the trailer. And then uh, we're probably going to sleep probably a night on the side of the road on the trailer. And then after that, once we uh, drive a little bit further the next day, pick up the ATV and another trailer in order to actually tow the ATV behind the trailer. So it's going to be quite a long load. Um, But this is going to be a very fun trip. And uh, first things first, man, we got to go ahead and pick up some food. Maybe stop by Dunkin Donuts or something, you know, get me a quick coffee. Maybe star block but i already did pack everything last night into the truck so uh let's get ready and head on the road all right so i gotta put my shoes on here and uh, we gotta make sure we lock the door but um here is the truck all right so we're taking out this huge truck right here today uh because as i said man we're gonna have a pretty heavy load we're gonna have a trailer and then we're gonna have another like smaller uh bumper trailer which we're gonna pull the atv in so it's gonna be quite a uh, heavy load so got this huge truck this truck does not even fit into the garage so i had it parked out here last night but uh, let's go ahead and reverse this thing out and head on the road and uh first things first pick up some coffee for myself it's gonna be quite a long road trip so uh, we're definitely gonna want to pick up some coffee of some sort um to be able to you know stay awake you know i definitely do not want to fall asleep especially driving this huge truck right here all right so we're here at dip and donuts coffee and uh let's go ahead and grab me coffee and maybe even a donut for the road right, so i got myself a coffee and a glazed donut perfect Perfect breast, perfect breakfast, if you ask me. And I also grab myself frozen coffee for later on the road because this is gonna be a multi-hour road trip. So you know I gotta stay ready, but I didn't get too much because you know I can for sure just stop. If there's any shops along the road, I can definitely stop. And uh, I was gonna get some gas, but it looks like we're pretty full on gas right now, so we should be chilling. Let's go ahead and head onto the road because uh, this is gonna be quite a long road trip. All right, man. So that was a pretty dang long uh, road trip there, but uh, it's bright and early right now in the morning, and um. I'm here in the trailer as you guys can see so I did successfully pick up my trailer oh my goodness dude this is a tiny restroom but a pretty nice trailer I mean very modern trailer nothing much in it right now um but I mean I have more than I need we have a counter right here we can uh, you know cook up some food we got a chair right here this is where I was eating my dinner last night but um this is actually a stretched out area right here so I'm gonna have to close this right here side camper there we go close that up yo it is early in the morning now. I'm extremely tired as you guys can see so as i was saying you can actually toggle the side door here so you can toggle it and widen the camper right here to give yourself a little bit more room this is extremely cool you know very very cool um but we're gonna close it for now since we're gonna head on the road let's just hop inside the car here and as you guys can see oh my goodness this car is beautiful tons of room in here we even got some back seats back there but um amazing look at this dude this is sick but uh let's go ahead and head on the road and we actually need to pick up our second um bumper trailer in the back here as you guys can see the hitch back there uh because we're gonna need to pick up our atv all right we're gonna have lots of fun with the atv i'm pretty excited to pick that up we're gonna be off-roading with that that's just gonna be so much fun uh here's the camper store yeah here we go trailers rented it out so they should have it ready so let's go ahead and line this thing up let's check where our uh trailer and atv is and see if they can actually take it out for us so i'm gonna just park up over here for now and uh head inside and talk with them all right man so they brought out the atv over here for us as well as our trailer and this is looking pretty nice so let's go ahead and uh put down the ramp here so we can load up the atv real quick it's gonna be pretty difficult i mean this atv is looking pretty dang narrow compared to the ramp here we got a huge little hole in the middle there but uh all right it's gonna be no problem i guess so boom just load it up real quick quick and uh, we'll strap it up right there pretty nice pretty nice strap it up and let's put up the ramp again and let's go ahead and load our trailer um and uh, hook it up with the back of the atv trailer real quick all right so that took some work but it looks like we have it all connected and oh my goodness dude this is crazy all right oh my yo look at this we got such a long load and uh, i'm a horrible driver already with one trailer so two trailers is crazy but uh, i actually said i did have a, a rented cabin over here so i'm gonna probably just drop off the trailer and we're gonna take the atv off-road and have some fun right since we're not really gonna be needing the trailer much anymore we might use it later on but right now man we gotta gotta drop this thing off man it's a little too much for me so uh let's load this thing in and uh drop off the trailer at the house right here honestly so let's park it up right here and uh Let's just drop off the trailer and put it inside the garage real quick. All right, so I moved the trailer into the garage here and, uh, 
we're gonna hook up the atv there we go and now we're gonna back up or yeah backing up is a little good it's gonna be a little hard so we're just gonna go off and right here with the chuck a little bit and uh now the load is a lot smaller and this is a lot better for me all right i'm liking this a lot more and um let's just, let's head this way all right let's head this way and uh, see if we can find any nice off-road little trails for our atv here i see a lot of mud down there that's crazy tons of mud down there um let's see uh, yeah all right this is not looking so good let's uh let's do a right turn so we see if we can find any interesting trails so far i'm just seeing a bunch of sand dunes bunch of sand dunes what do we have here uh, we got some houses and different stuff like that looks like we're coming up to a dead end here a cliff off the mountain oh my goodness yeah we're definitely gonna need a u-turn and find ourselves a better trail all right this is not looking very good i'm about to fall into the ocean right there so uh, let's head back this way see if we can find any interesting trails that we can take the atv on. all right man so this seems like a pretty decent area right here we're just gonna unload the rv and check out these back roads real quick because uh this is looking pretty interesting we got some stuff we got mud over there and everything so let's just uh unload the rtv and see if we can get some action in right here and uh i don't think anybody's gonna steal my show hopefully not man hopefully not i don't think anybody's gonna steal it but let's see what we have over here so we got tons of mud over there that's a little too deep for the atv here i'm not gonna lie we could check it out though and what do we have over here hmm let's see let's see okay we got a weight limit this seems to be a pretty uh old bridge right here and we got a bunch of bunch of rivers man and we have a trail over here i'm not sure how we can get onto it though so let's just continue down this road over here uh, but we got a bunch of farming land and stuff like this over here pretty interesting i don't see no cattle or anything what do we have here is this somebody's property okay this is a barn we definitely don't want to trespass yeah we definitely do not want to trespass but it looks like this is just another dead end so let's, let's head the other way i saw like i saw a pretty interesting hill going up a mountain so let's head over there and see if there's anything interesting over there all right looks like we do have a trail right there that's a pretty interesting trail though. let's head down here and see if there's anything else it looks like we have a trail right here we got another bridge right here yo these bridges are looking very very dangerous i'm not even gonna lie we got a house up here and nothing really over there so let's just go ahead and check out these little off-road trails down here we got lake over there that's pretty interesting we definitely do not want to go into the lake uh we're probably gonna head this way let's head down this way but uh, the atv is holding up pretty well i'm not gonna lie the atv is holding up pretty well pretty decent speeds and everything but uh this trail is seems it seems to just be going around this lake here pretty interesting oh my goodness it is bumpy geez and okay so this trail leads to this nice area right here you can fish and stuff right here this will be a nice fishing area let's try not to oh yo oh my goodness try not to fall into the lake so let's head back this way and see if there's anything interesting on the other trail if not we can just go muddy there was some mudding near the uh near the trailer rental place so let's head back up and head this way see if there's anything interesting yeah this thing is pretty quick jeez okay yo this is a very steep can we even make it up this oh my goodness jeez oh yo we're sliding right now oh my goodness we're barely making it up yo this atv is struggling right now jeez oh my goodness what is even up here okay we made it up we made it up right and okay what in the world this is so risky oh my goodness i'm i'm going back down this is way too risky especially on the atv man let's just head back down near the trailer area and uh, do some mudding here because uh, i'm not trying to be on the tippy top of the mountain with this atv man all right so let's load up the atv here safely okay yo chill safely uh yo this is a lot of work i'm not gonna lie man this is a lot of work uh but let's head back over to the mudding area and uh i think we're gonna have some fun over there i saw a lot of people down there off-roading as well so uh i guess that's gonna be pretty fun um definitely don't want to get stuck in the mud though especially with the atv man but um here we i think it's over here right where's the off-road i think yeah it's down here so let's get it go ahead and park up over here i think the trail starts over here if i'm not wrong okay so right here there we go let's go ahead and park up right here here and uh let's take off the atv here we go put the ramp down unbuckle the atv here and boom safe and sound so let's go ahead and head on to this little muddy trail right here very interesting so this is a little bit more uh safe with the atv you know not many hills and stuff this yeah it's very risky with the atv we got some water right here let's see if we can go through it okay okay the atv is taking it well hold up hold up yo 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 we stuck oh my goodness Okay, that was risky and this looks even deeper than the other one so we're definitely not going through this one right here so we're just gonna go on the side over here because that puddle is looking a little too deep for my liking um but all right here we go muddy so we got some mud oh my goodness yo the atv is completely dirty now oh my goodness i'm still clean though okay 
what yo all right scratch what i just said all right i'm not clean anymore Jeez, oh my goodness this is so much work and it is so risky just taking the atv through this look how deep we're literally sinking into the mud oh my goodness you can't even see the atv no more okay yo yeah we gotta get out of there man i'm not trying to get stuck with the atv inside the mud but um yeah oh my goodness dude this atv is holding up well and this is uh how do we get up here Let's see if we can get up here there we go there we go okay okay yeah, man, the ATV, this is a pretty nice ATV. I'm gonna have to leave a pretty good review. But, uh, yeah, man, this is pretty fun, especially with the ATV, man. Oh, my goodness. Yo, cannot control the ATV, but what does this guy have? Hold up, what is that? Oh, my goodness, dude, the ATV is stalling now, bro. Is, it, is there mud stuck in the engine or something? Dude, this thing does not want to move. Jeez, what the heck? But uh, I'm trying to check out what this guy has. Hold up. Oh, my goodness, this guy has a whole entire doom machine right here yo that's crazy next time i go here i might have to rent that but for now we just got this little atv this thing held up pretty well look at this oh my goodness look at that engine that's looking sick jeez but that's probably gonna be it for me man i'm not trying to mud anymore as now this was a pretty successful mudding trip pretty successful camping trip overall i really recommend you guys hop out here if you guys have time but let's go ahead and load up the atv here and um i think i'm gonna conclude the camping trip man i say this is a pretty fun successful camping trip um you know we had lots of fun stayed in the trailer for a day went muddy you know we rented out all this stuff right here and uh, you know we had some fun and there's actually so much people up here i'm not gonna lie lots of people up here with trailers renting trailers and stuff having fun as you guys saw that other dude he had a whole dune buggy which is pretty sick i'm gonna have to check that out later on um if we do decide to visit here again yeah i say this is a pretty successful camping trip um let me know what you guys think of this camping trip i'm probably going to conclude this video here man it's been fun make sure you guys go ahead and comment down any video ideas you guys would like to see in the future make sure to also drop a like as well subscribe as it really does help out the channel and i'll see you guys all in the next one